Hey everyone, welcome to Whiskey Web Wednesday. Very exciting news from Shelter Point for this Wednesday video. We have released our first ever 10 year age statement whiskey. And if you subscribe to Trini and C, uh, they also released their review of the 10 year old and they were lucky enough to be here um, as we released it. So this is my take on it and I thought I'd just add a few thoughts as well. So hopefully between these two videos you can get a good impression as to what the 10 year old Shelter Point is all about. And for us this is a big achievement whiskey. Uh, back in July 2011 the first drips of Aquavite came off the stills. You know this is the first spirit run and here we are August 2021 10 years later celebrating the results of that first distillation. Um, so it's been a wonderful journey getting here. Um, it was a great vision from Patrick Evans and James Marinus putting Shelter Point together, a beautiful building, beautiful distillery, and then getting to this point here is a massive well done to all concerned. So um, this is our celebration. It comes in at $130 plus tax. So it's around about 150 bucks, including tax. 57.8% alcohol, so we're talking full cast strength here. And for this, we just wanted to do a traditional single malt. So this is aged entirely in ex bourbon, and I know these casks were all Jack Daniels, ex Jack Daniels casks, so Tennessee bourbon. No chill filtration. Um, no added colour. It says here a lot has changed in the world since Shelter Point started production in 2011. And I did a little Google search of what was happening back in uh, July 2011. And uh, it was when the Atlantis Space Shuttle landed at uh, the Space Center, Kennedy Space Center, and that was the last time. So that was the end of an epic journey and a great adventure of NASA's shuttle program. So I think that was a nice point for a new adventure to start. Uh, this time taking Shelter Point, hopefully, into outer space someday. Um, also, that was pretty much the time I got married as well, so my anniversary ties in nicely uh, with this whiskey here. So let's give it a go. Ten-year-old Shelter Point. managed to get our glass stoppers back for this one so if you've missed them for the last couple of releases we managed to, to refill our stock so we're back to the good old glass stoppers now. Ah. Classic shelter point, just barley sugars, lots of vanilla and caramel from the ex-bourbon casks, a lot of fruitiness from that long fermentation remember Especially in the early days, our fermentations were maybe up to seven days. It's like a little dance through the sweet shop, this one. Honeyed notes as well. Mm. Rich, complex. The age is doing the spirit wonders. It's starting to show maturity now. It's no longer a naughty teenager. This one's actually got a proper job. Maybe it's got a mortgage. Maybe it's got some assets. Yeah, this is a, a growing up shelter point. Hmm. And I know my friend, my good friend Adam Drummond, he got a bottle of this and he says it's pretty much gone already. So that's pretty impressive considering it came out just a few days ago. It's a relatively small release we're talking here. It's only about four casks, uh, maybe a total of 450 bottles, and uh, most of it was sold on the first day. So a fantastic response. So well done if you got one of these. Mm, delicious. Mm. Now for a wee touch of water. Mm. 
it really does show the age, the maturation. A lot of shelter points have been bottled at maybe five, six, seven years old. So this is really a step up, you know, in terms of that maturity profile, the age, and it, it's it's got those rich notes like um, maybe a bit of leather and tobacco coming through. Excellent. Okay, well, hope you enjoyed that little review of the 10 year old. Um, please help us celebrate this marvellous achievement by getting to 10 years at Shelter Point. And here's to another 10. Hopefully, we'll see you around for a 20 year old in 10 years' time. Cheers, everyone.